Hi, I'm Charlotte Lawson, a registered licensed dietitian here in Tampa Bay, Florida. I'm going to cover what an overview of a 1400 calorie diet plan might look like. First and foremost, make sure if you're doing a restricted diet like this that you're actually getting the amount of calories you need. Try to check into a calculation, one that's very simple and just kind of an easy basis to go off. Take your weight, divide it by 2.2 to convert it to kilograms, and estimate 25 to 30 calories per kilogram of body weight. That should give you a well-rounded idea of what your body weight, or excuse me, the calories you need to maintain that body weight. If you are still set on following a 1400 calorie diet, this is kind of an overview of what you would need to make sure you're getting all of the food groups. It's very important you still eat foods from every food group as they all have different essential nutrients like vitamins and minerals that we need for our regular body's functioning. Try to aim for five ounces of grains per day and try to make half of these grains whole. Whole grains provide us excellent sources of fiber and vitamins and minerals. Fiber helps us to stay full and can actually help with our overall caloric intake for the whole day. Moving on, try to get one and a half or one and one and a half cups of both your fruits and vegetables. And this is a good place to cheat because your fruits and vegetables are very low in calories, but also excellent sources of those vitamins and minerals and often fiber as well. So try to aim for about one and a half of each group. Next, looking at your milk and dairy group, try to get two cups of low fat or fat free dairy products. This can be fluid milk or things like cottage cheese or part skim cheeses. Also aim for about four ounces of your meat or meat alternative group. Meat alternatives meaning your beans or soy products, other vegetable products that contain these good essential proteins for us. And again, make sure they're lean because often the meats can contain the bad fats and that also raises your calorie amount. For more information on calorie restricted diets and just following a diet plan in general, check out eathappy.info. I'm Charlotte and eat happy.